GoPSUSports.com here with uh, Penn State Hockey Equipment Manager Adam Sheehan. Adam, can you run me over the uh, this week's process of moving all hockey equipment from Greenberg Pavilion up here to the new Pagula Ice Arena? Uh, a little bit of controlled chaos. We we're in between three different uh, storage rooms between Greenberg and East Area Locker Room. So we, over the last few weeks, maybe a month, we've been starting to uh, get everything together, the nuts and bolts of everything, uh, boxing everything up, getting it prepped for today. And uh, at 6 o'clock this morning, I had myself, my assistant, and uh, all five of my student managers. We've been loading stuff up, moving it over here throughout the day, and uh, we'll be here for probably quite a while until everything's ready to go. And how long do you anticipate this process will take? As long as it takes. We have a practice at uh, 4 o'clock on uh, Monday for both, both programs, so we're going to be here until it's done. And what challenges have you run into so far in this move? Uh, I think just logistically being in three different places uh, doing Greenberg and East Area we had uh, two equipment rooms storage rooms at Greenberg we had one at East Area so kind of deciding what we were going to bring over and what order uh, my assistant Graham Peppermint took care of a lot of that said okay we're going to bring this stuff first so and uh, my biggest challenge this morning was just getting everything that had already previously been sent here that was in my storage room out of there and into the locker room area so we could make room for everything that was coming over for Greenberg. And can you briefly describe the process of moving from uh, Greenberg to Pagula starting from when it was announced last July? Uh, I got here July 1st uh, last summer and you know, within a few days the entire training staff, uh, myself, the strength coach, the athletic trainer were all involved in several meetings uh, uh, getting our input on designs for the locker room or change areas, uh, the locker stalls, storage rooms. So that's been pretty much a year-long process uh, as far as that. There's been a lot of changes in between, you know, when we first got there and uh, or first when we first got into town until now. Um, but you know, slowly as you know, we get closer, you see the finished product and things need to be tweaked here and there. Which uh, you know, luckily we were able to do pretty much everything we really needed to do. How long do you anticipate for this arena to really feel like home for the men and women's teams coming in? Uh, it's home to me right now. <laughs> uh, I, I I know there's a the history of the the club program everyone has been pretty attached to Greenberg um, so I know there's a lot of history there but getting into a facility like this and uh, being able to have everything in you know one central location it's uh, it's home instantly for me and could you take me through the day-to-day -day routine of an equipment manager during the season uh, practice days you know we'll get here early in the morning I'll sharpen any skates that need to be done from the day before uh, finishing up laundry folding towels, making sure the players' laundry loops are in their lockers, uh, any equipment repairs that need to be done from the day before. Uh, myself, taking care of any purchasing, uh, inventory stuff uh, you know, leading into the future. So we have to order all our equipment, all our Nike apparel, uh, almost a year in advance. So you know, basically once we get here to start a new season, I'm already prepping for the next season. And uh, last question, how exciting is it for you to be such an integral part of this brand new program that's starting a new tradition here at Penn State in Hockey Valley. Uh, huge. I, I heard about the possibility of this program happening about two years before it did, and once it was actually officially announced, uh, within that first few weeks, I was I was hammering everybody that would listen to me as far as emails are concerned, getting everything uh, uh, kind of in line to hope to get a chance to have it. As many people as I knew were putting in for it, uh, I was obviously pretty happy when I got it.